certainly have when a threat like that comes out and especially on the eve of this anniversary it really does resonate throughout all of our counties and including right here in macomb where the homeland security portion of its emergency management division is reaching out to do its part we know that it's not a specific threat to this particular area because there really hasn't been a lot of information given to us but over the last 10 years they've done a great job meaning the federal agencies state local law enforcement and counties to kind of come together to disseminate information if and when it's something that's viable for this area for us to be tuned into macomb county executive mark hackle tells us good connections are the key to staying on top of safety We've got some great partnerships with federal, uh, state, and county law enforcement here, and we're working with the sheriff's department right now to coordinate efforts for a communication center with the sheriff, along with our roads department and our homeland security. So we're doing things even internally, along with our partners that we have in law enforcement, to get better sense of communications, not only for us but for the public as well. And he says we also have gems like Selfridge Air National Guard Base, and we've all come together in the past 10 years in different ways to make sure that we stay on top of threats like these. Live in Macomb County, I'm Glenda Lewis. Carolyn, back to you.